All right, here we go, everyone. We are now on part 11 of more the Mortal Kombat 1 story. Hope you guys are enjoying this little series. It's been really cool to play. Don't know what I'm going to be focusing on next after this, but uh, I might do another Instagram poll. Uh, if you do not follow me on here, it's at Stanford Plays. And uh, you can take part in the little story poll that I have going on where I let you guys decide, all my followers, uh, what gaming series you want to see next. Either streams or in video form. But, uh, yeah, can't wait to see what the rest of this game has in store, so... Without further ado, let's get back into it. Oh, how could I have so misjudged them? For shame soon to indulge in such depravity. For General Shao to condone it. They are not the men I thought them. Despite my best efforts, neither man nor Quan Chi are who they were meant to be. They're not your responsibility. They're outworlders. But it is I who crafted their destinies, along with those of all other beings at the dawn of history. You created the realms. I is your mind addled, demigod? I am a mere demigod now. But eons ago, I was more powerful than all of the Elder Gods combined. I was a titan, and the keeper of time. This is Gyrus. Your Majesty. Your Highnesses. Gyrus is the guardian of the Hourglass. A celestial object which lies beyond the realms. The Hourglass regulates time and destiny. When I wielded its power, it was upon me to craft all of existence, which I did when I restarted history. Restarted? This timeline was preceded by billions more, though this is the first of Liu Kang's design. The others were designed by his predecessor. Kronika was obsessed with equalizing good and evil. When a timeline veered too far to one or the other, she would halt it and restart history, tinkering with lives and events in the hope of achieving her golden balance. Prior timelines, Kronika gave Shang Tsung and Quan Chi mastery of the most vile magics. Shao was not a general, a tyrannical ruler bent on conquest. You, Sindel, were his ruthless wife who would do anything to preserve your privilege. When I took the hourglass from Kronika, I vowed to do better. So in this timeline, the sorcerers would not gain their dark powers. Shao would be your loyal follower, and you would rule Outworld firmly, but fairly. But someone has interfered with Liu Kang's design. Shao? Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, all have been groomed by an unknown entity to be the villains they were in previous timelines. Where to begin? Am I to kneel to my creator? Do you expect worship? No, your majesty. My prior role was thrust upon me by circumstance. I am in no way divine. You had power over all of creation, yet you gave it up. Because I saw how it drove Kronika mad. I knew I would fare no better had I kept it. You. How dare you conspire against Outworld? Not against Outworld, but against your misguided rule. Your deference to him leaves us all vassals. So you sanction these unspeakable horrors? Lie to me about the threats we face? Thanks to you, Earthrealm blood is already on my hands. Bloodshed, without cause or provocation. Don't move. Empress, everyone, stay back. What is it? The Amulet of Shinnok. A weapon of terrifying power. It should not exist. 
Its maker is powerless, as Liu Kang designed. Yet more proof of foreign interference. Enough, brother! You both bend me to Outworld's new emperor. Put down the amulet. Its evil is beyond your control. <laughs> do you think I do battle, not train with my weapons? I am more than prepared. <laughs> So General Shao casts his lot with Outworld's enemies against me. He's a fool to ally with you blood-sucking fiends. Fight! Alright, let's go! Play this in now! Can you stop? Mega Fox, can you stop? Really? You're dodging them attacks very easily, aren't you? Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Ah, Lee, may help me! No! No! Oh, she's so cheap! Oh, she's gonna win this one. Please, please tell me this gets her. Please, for the love of God. Yes! Come on! Fight! Oh, jeez, man! I really hate. I really hate the Tara. I really do. I really do hate the Tara. I am not losing against the Tara. I'll tell you that now. Oh, we're actually going pretty decent. Ow! Oh, oh, you wasted that. You, oh, no, you did. No, you did. Oh, Goro! Jeez! Oh, my God. Oh, no, I'm not... Ah! Oh, I've lost it, I've lost it, I've lost it. What? I touched it! Oh, Jesus, it's difficult. I, can you stop? Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh my god, this is awful. Oh, stop it! Oh my god, can you stop? Stop it! Jeez! Ah! Come on, please, please. Oh my god, that was so close. You're no better than Shang Tsung's monstrosities. Tanya and your daughters, they are not dead, but trapped in the amulet. We can still save them. party to Shao's treason. Know that it will cost you your life. I owe him mine many times over. Sacrificing it in his service would be an honor. Fight. Oh yeah, I bet. Oh, same move again, man! Right, here we go. Come on. Same again! Stop! 
Are you kidding me right now? I, I thought the Taru was annoying, but you are definitely proving something else, aren't you? Oh my god! Well, let's get behind him. I tried to dodge, I tried to dodge, I tried to dodge, it did not work. It's not working, it does it working. Hello? Ah, oh, you didn't get it on time, did you? Haha, let's go. Ah! Oh, we counted it. We can't. No! Oh, I stopped him. Me attack stopped him. Your rebellion is doomed. Your betrayal hurts most, Rain. I thought of you as a son. I've outgrown you, Empress. Shang Tsung's taught me that I've scratched just the surface of my power. To explore it, I can't be bound by your limits. Fight! Time to set you down, Rain. God damn it! Stop! Stop it! Are you kidding me? Shout! No one asked you to be here! Shut up. But bro, just taking like two. Oh my god! Are you. What? Oh, here we go. Come on now. Yeah, you took too long, mate. Oh, okay. Of course, you're blocking. Oh, I dodged it! Light as rain! Come on now! Come on! Come on! You are forever dead to me. Your reign is over, Sindel! I remember the weak, sickly boy you were. How your father fought to push you past your infirmities. Now you repay him by spitting on his ideals? Your revolt shreds every value he held dear. Fight! Alright, it's gotta be a final fight. Shit! Ah! Ah! Come on then, come on, come on Shao Kahn. Come on then. Oh really? Really Reiko? You've forsaken both me and the Empire. Your family name will be forever tarnished. Uh oh. Are oh, we both missing? It's beyond me. God damn it! Oh, what am I doing? What? Why? You are relieved, General. The amulet, Your Majesty. I 
I hate to disrupt, but we must act quickly to save Earthrealm. Is that the command of my creator? No, your majesty. It is the request of a friend. Right. Well, that was another cool episode. I mean, these cutscenes are getting a bit more shorter now, and these videos are getting shorter. So, guys, I've got to go to leave it here for this part of Mortal Kombat 1. I'm really hoping that we at least get to play as Smoke. That is the one character we have not mainly played as as a good guy, I, I believe, just yet. But uh, I think it's Melina next, so yeah, that'll be a good episode. So anyway, I will leave it here. If you guys did enjoy this, please do leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one.